going on everybody? It's your boy B here back with another installment of Ask Me Shit. You know where you send me your questions, whatever they may be, and I give you my answers from my perspective. No hose bar, you feel me? So let's start off with the first question, alright? And it's um if I had a chance to bust a fat load on a celebrity actress's face, who would it be and why? Well, this is a no-brainer for me. This is no. I would say J Lo, Jennifer Lopez. I know she may be old and all that, but she still look good as fuck, and that ass is still popping. And I would love to bust a load on her face. Why? Because she's a hoe, man. I always thought she was a slut, so I know she would like it. I know she would enjoy it. I know she would let me. So that's my answer. To be honest with you, man, even when J-Lo's like 60 years old, man, I think I still want to be. She's going to go from MILF to GILF. She's going to cross over. You know what I'm saying? So that's my answer. J-Lo, bust a load all over her face. <laughs> and um, next question. Uh, what's my workout split? That's, um, I'm just doing push-pull legs. Just keeping it simple. Um, first week I would go heavy, the second week I would do more hypertrophy work and that's pretty much what I've been doing for a while now and in between sometimes I might throw a deadlift day just where I do all kinds of deadlifts, um, conventional sumos, snatch grip and, and then I would just throw a deadlift day maybe on an off day or just throw it in between somewhere in the middle it feels good that way to me. Now, sometimes I just do my sumos with my legs, but most of the times I have a deadlift day where I know I haven't recorded this in a while, but I do my deadlift circuit. And on top of the circuit that I do, I also do, like I said, sumos, conventionals, and um, snatch grip deadlifts, all right? And also the, the hex bar deadlifts as well on the trap bar. All right, next question is, will I stay natural for life? Hell motherfucking yeah, I will. There's just no reason for me to get on gear. I'm not gonna be competing or anything. At least I don't think I am. And to be honest with you, I've seen natural dudes who are big as fuck. And I think I could achieve that size, you know, being big as fuck naturally. You know, I already have a big frame. You know, once I sculpt it a little bit, we'll see what I'm working with. Um. I know when it comes to men, after the age of 30, your testosterone drops. So if that's the case with me, then at that time I might consider TRT, testosterone replacement therapy. But by the time that happens, I will already have a lot of experience and I already have built a foundation. So I won't be dependent on that testosterone to help me make my gains because I already have made my gains by then. Uh, next question is... The last question actually is my top three favorite rappers of all time, and that's Biggie, Jay-Z, and Nas, man. I'm from New York. Those are my favorite rappers. I grew up on, on their music, you know, especially Nas. You know, Nas is my dude right there. And then a close fourth and fifth, I would have to go Jay the Kiss and then Big Pun. Again, keep it in old New York. You know, I respect everybody else, you know, Tupac and... Dre and Snoop and all of them, but those are my favorite rappers. And I guess that's it, guys. Send me your questions by form of private message, and I will be sure to answer all of them, you know, in due time. All right, I know sometimes I don't reply to your private messages, but I'm gonna start changing that. It's all about, you know, getting used to it. But, anyways, I appreciate you guys watching. Remember, send me those questions and I'll answer them. Y'all hold it down.